His hands were green. He was headed towards the makeup department. So obviously, he's going to be that shade of color green, which is badass. He should be green. But now we finally see that he is going to have a big head. Not a really big head, but he is going to have a bigger head. And he's going to have a fucking beard, uh, which is kind of cool. Uh, look, this guy's a good actor, period. Tim Blake Nelson's a good actor. He is. Uh, I loved him in uh, Old Brother, Where Out Thou? He's fucking, that's a fucking crazy movie. Um, I don't think this will be a good movie. Because this movie was already filmed. And Kevin Feige has gone back and reshot it and changed the ending. This movie was going to have this serpent society in it. And the entire serpent society has been cut out. And new stuff is being filmed as we speak. To fill in the gaps of what they cut out. And that is Kevin Feige's decision. After he came back from vacation or whatever the fuck he was doing that Marvel fucked up the last three and a half years. He went on vacation and now he's trying to fix things, but he's making it worse by trying to fix things. All right? That's all I'm saying. Uh, so Kevin Feige's coming in and chopped off the Serpent Society. This is a movie that's involving Theodore Thunderbolt Ross not only becoming president of the United States of America, but becoming the Red Hulk, meaning the leader has some kind of Hulk DNA or serum in order to give it to Ross to turn into the fucking th Red Hulk. All right. So that's part of it. The Hulk is not in this. Mark Ruffalo is not in this. And She-Hulk is not in this. The three main components to your story are not in this. On top of that, originally, the story was supposed to be about them going to Tiamat, the celestial that came out of the ocean, and the government wanting to get vibrating, right? Because it's like adamantium from it, because the skeleton's made out of adamantium. But Kevin Feige has come in and completely changed everything, so no one right now knows what this movie is about, except for the fact that it's Captain America versus the leader, which is primarily a Hulk villain, and the Red Hulk, which is also a Hulk villain. Yet, this movie does not have Mark Ruffalo, the Hulk, in it, and does not have uh, that little girl, She-Hulk, in it either. So yeah, this movie's gonna be ass. Kevin Feige needs to be fired. I don't know what's going on. No one knows what's going on. Kevin Feige doesn't know what's going on. And Tim Blake, Blake N Nelson, even though he's going to kill it and knock it out of the park with whatever he, they give him, he probably doesn't know what's going on either. And it's going to suck ass because of that. Hey, if you like this kind of content, how about giving this a like and a subscribe? And if you want to watch the full show, click on the link on the right or check the description.